Hi everyone. I'm Amy. I'm from North Carolina. I was a 16 year old with my first serious boyfriend when I got pregnant. He was quite a bit older than me and my parents didn't approve. They knew this was an unhealthy relationship and it caused great tension in my family. I was scared to go to my parents so when he suggested abortion I went along with it. I was from a Christian home, so I was ashamed, and I didn't want my family to be disappointed in me or to bring that same shame onto them. So he handed me a wad of cash and dropped me off at the abortion clinic that day. I remember feeling scared and anxious, feeling completely alone. I still don't remember much about the abortion itself. I think I blocked it out. I felt a mix of emotions. There was a bit of relief that no one would know my secret, but afterwards, I could not hide the pain in my heart. It manifested in anger and depression, so I covered it up with drugs, alcohol, and promiscuity that led to another abortion. I was on a path of self-destruction. I had an I don't care attitude throughout the rest of my teen years, damaging relationships and feeling lost. I felt like trash, so in turn, I acted like trash. At 19, I got pregnant for the third time and I chose to parent, realizing my self-destructive path couldn't continue and so I straightened up. But I dealt with decades of low self-worth and self-loathing, stuffing it in a box and pretending I was okay. Years later, God led me to a recovery group where the enemy's stronghold on my mind was broken he led me to the light and he gave me freedom to let those hurts out of the box and he has shown me a way to use that pain for good God's purpose for my life was revealed only after I was obedient to him and said yes to recovery God used abortion recovery ministry to mend my broken heart and I give him all the glory for my transformed life and that's why I'll be silent no more Woo!